can this be? Thank you. But my friends who couldn't get away, are they okay? We know they were students. What's that? I mean, I kind of had a feeling I was like, The crit rate ain't that high, but it feels like it happens a lot more than in Darkest Dungeon. Um, dang. Oh, hold on. A man wants to talk. You really think you can keep going? Don't push yourself too hard. Thinking about what happened at Ramire Village, it's clear you've gotten the hang of being a leader. Maybe you should have taken command of me too. <laughs> Thanks. That was worth the turn. Heals all allies within range? Holy shit! All builds relationship? Oh, I'm not on a relationship with my dad. <laughs> Gotta have the Triforce. It's the only way we can kill the giant pig man at the end of the game. Been pretty fun. So far. Run! Yeah, it's a JRPG. What else are you gonna fight? Literally no other option. Hilda, why don't you head over here? Scythia, you can try to catch him. Gods are dragons in this epic. This checks out. Odd, my man. So that's just a fire emblem thing. I actually wanted you to go all the way. What the fuck is this? Yo, stop killing the kid. <laughs> you said it. Yeah, right. here. Oh no, Gerald. Girl, yeah, you're not that strong. go still a little far. 
Don't you have a... Get murdering. It's the least I could do. It's the least I could do. You're relentless. I was so scared. A way to repay you, I promise. Oh, Raphael, uh, why don't you uh, take a breather? Thank you, Laticus. For the chaos. <laughs> Damn, hello. Your strength in inside. Looks like all the matters. Man. Uh, can you gambit? We can handle that. No time like the present. We got his attention, fellers. Be largely irrelevant here in a second. I did it. I did. I don't know, man. If it looks like a dragon, I'm impressed. Breathes fire like. A sorry, dragon. that was a close one. You should be sorry. <gasps> you saved me. Thank you. Energy drop. Put it in the store. Yo, we got the Umbral Steel! Oh, I have no idea. Trace of evidence to be found in the chapel. This must have something to do with Remire. Perhaps. Wait! Wait! Huh? Another student? Run along now. Thanks for all your help, sir. <laughs> <laughs> You're just a pathetic old man. Damn! How dare you get in the way of my brilliant plan? Holy yeah. shit! Run along now. Thanks for all your help, sir. Killer. <laughs> oh, snap. That's fucked up. Huh? What are you doing here? You must survive. Merely because there is still a role that I require you to fulfill. <laughs> Who could have foreseen that she was evil? <laughs> Sorry. It looks like I'm going to have to leave you now. Huh? 
Sag. To think that the yeah. first time I so buff the thing he was gonna tell. Here, tears oh, you shut me. up, dude! Tell me what you were gonna talk Sad. about. And yet, <laughs> thank you, kid. Oh, if only I wasn't playing on classic. He totally survived this. <laughs> Cried so much it started raining. Man. Should have known. The chapter was called The Cause of Sorrow. Also, it was very obviously leading up to his death. Are you still crying? You're crying. <laughs> if turning back the hands of time was not enough to save his life, you must accept what came to pass was fate. It's not Control fate. Yourself. It's someone else Control that could also deal with time. The hands of wicked ones. A fate is still a fate. Yeah, like a lot. Oh, the last like four conversations he had. We're basically like, whatever is behind that book like right, we didn't try. I was like, what if we go back further? Try that. Oh. Your father's diary. Huh. His but there's so many times where I'm like, he would, would suggest. say like, you know, foreboding oh, stuff. And I'm like, hey, don't die. He's like, oh, don't worry, I'm not going to die. Your birth. Uh, you're going to die. He seems to have been writing this for quite some time. Hmm? Oh. Read that part there. Horsebow Moon, year 1159. Day 20 of the Horsebow Moon. All is cloudy. I can't believe she's dead. Lady Rhea said she died during childbirth. <laughs> but is that the truth? It's dead, still, kill the student! The child she <laughs> traded her life for doesn't make a sound. Didn't even cry at birth. Day 25 of the Horsebow Moon. It's raining. The baby doesn't laugh or cry. Not ever. Lady Rhea says not to worry about a baby that doesn't cry. It isn't natural. I had a doctor examine the child in secret. He said the pulse is normal, but there's no heartbeat. No heartbeat? Day 2 of the Wyvern Moon. Sunny. I feel huh? I must take the child and leave. But the church is always watching us. I don't know what Lady Rhea has planned. I used to think the world of Lady Rhea. Now I'm terrified of her. Day 8 of the Wyvern Moon. More rain. I used the fire that broke out last night to fake the child's death. Lady Rhea is in a state over the news, but I can't change what I've done. I've got to take the child and leave. Phoenix. <laughs> oh, no. That baby must be you. That means hmm? someone is approaching us. Falls down immediately, gets back up. Ah, here you are. To think that Captain, that Gerald would meet his end like that. I hope you know that you were the most important thing in the world to him. He wasn't the most emotional guy. I'm sure expressing his affection wouldn't have come naturally to him. After what's happened, it's up to me now. I, Alois, swear to protect you in the captain's stead. Bruh. <sighs> Sorry. This I, uh... Isn't the time for my blathering. I think you're strong enough to be Lady my... Lady Rhea is looking for you. I came to tell you that. I'll take my leave now. This book is filled with secrets yet unknown. We must return another time to read the rest. Oh, but I have at least figured one thing out. I know now why our fates are intertwined. You're just gonna leave it there as a cliffhanger, aren't you? Yep, yep. Yep, 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 why wouldn't you? Professor, I have been waiting for you. I am filled with grief at the loss of our most celebrated knight. Gerald was an ally of many years. 
and also a dear friend. It was a long while back. At the time, Geralt was a soldier of the kingdom. He was injured in battle, and I saved him just as he was about to perish. That was our first meeting. After that, he became a knight of Seros. He gave his all in service of the church. He fell in love with one of the nuns here at Garrigmark. Their love produced a child whom she died giving birth to. It was her decision. She weighed her own life against that of her child's and, in the end, implored me to save the child. Your father never truly accepted that decision. He took the child, took you, and disappeared without warning. Your mother, she was my... Sorry for the interruption, mm -hmm. Lady Freya. There's something you must hear immediately. A report from the knights patrolling the area. Very well. Professor, you are dismissed for the day. Please rest and focus only on mending your heart. Understood? My heart doesn't beat. So, I think that's kind of irrelevant. <laughs> Part 1. White Clouds. Guardian Moon. Where the Goddess Dwells. Uh, how many parts are there in this game? Long ago, the Guardian Seros made an appearance during this moon. She had been summoned by the Goddess, whose soul was suffering as the flames of war raged across Fordland. Some believe that high in the sky above Seros, the Immaculate Ones, Mighty Wings, are what powered the There's strong a dragon. winds carrying the Guardian and her forces. <laughs> Low battle. 20s. Oh, God. This game's gonna be like 200 hours. Choose auto battle if you want to just walk away and let the game play itself. Day 5 of the Garland Moon, year 1157. Clear skies. I picked some flowers for her and returned home. The look of joy on her face at the sight of these flowers will be even more beautiful than the flowers themselves? Yeesh. That is an Wait, are you serious? 20 parts? His entries from before your birth are full of such romantic blatherings as that. Is is part one absurdly long or something? Be deeply moving you to hear We're still in part one. It's almost 20 hours of gameplay. You do not wish for them to see you in this state. So oh, okay. 20, 20 chapters is different. I thought I might find you here, Teach. Not the type to wallow in solitude, huh? I figured there'd be a lot of chapters. There's two so, parts. Okay. Woo. What were you reading? Holy shit. <laughs> is that Gerald? <laughs> That's making me panic a little bit. That's <laughs> <laughs> so it Dragon Quest 7. Oh, man. Hey, maybe this has some entries from when Gerald left the monastery. Is that so? He was the captain of the knights, but something made him leave the monastery in a hurry. If it has something to do with your birth, Knowing what happened may get us closer to knowing what secrets the church is hiding. Play Dragon Quest Seven. Teach. Uh, pass. Do you mind letting me read that diary? <laughs> we'll, I know how we'll add it to the list. I'm not asking lightly. Please allow me to borrow it. I'm forever in your debt, Teach. If you'd refused, I would have had to sneak in here in the dead of night. I wasn't looking forward to the prospect. Anyhow, let me fill you in on what's been going on lately, and not just as thanks for pointing me to that diary. Rhea dispatched the knights to various locations in a frantic search for the enemy. 
There's oh, a rumor no. that she's already secured some information. Something big is going to happen soon. That has me wondering. If you find out where the enemy is, <laughs> no, right? If you I was ask, like, I guess that's I... the right choice if you were just going to no, steal it anyway. All of us students would gladly lend a hand, even if that means going against Rhea's wishes. Don't forget it. Mm. Now go. Everyone's worried about you. You'd better show them you're in good spirits. Oh, thank you. You saved me. If you were to die, then the mystery of our bodies would be revealed. Preventing that was my only aim. I'm afraid you must remain, Kronya. There is something I need Anya. to do. Oh, of course. I am always happy to cooperate with Solon. Leave it to me. How annoying. Flame Emperor, is she offending you? Unfortunately, we cannot take our eyes off her, so there is nothing to be done. You are our greatest creation. We use the defiled beast's blood as the fuel to your flame, that you may burn even the gods. Now is the time to cleanse Fodlin with that power and bring forth our salvation. There will be no salvation for you and your kind. Those responsible for such gruesome deeds in Dusker and Enmar. All so that you may acquire the strength you need. All for a purpose. Okay. Plot dump. It's Ingrid's birthday. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Just standing there looking sad. House versus house bow tournament. We could get a. F sad. Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Poor Byleth. Also, I thought the name was Blythe originally, and then I heard. Bearbot say Byleth, and I had to double check. I was like, fuck, he's right. It is Byleth. What kind of stupid name is that? Uh, okay. We'll get through the stuttery area. This thing's loaded. Okay. Still weird. I, yeah. I don't know if I've ever seen anyone play it as dude. Better than Blythe? I think I've heard Blythe as an actual name before. That's so. <laughs> Please, no Dragon Quest 7. Uh, oh. Bernadetta's not there. Where is she? Oh, she's over here in the Night's Hall. Hmm. Isn't it awful? God, you guys just leave shit all over the fucking school. <laughs> Is that the whole game just leveling up? Do you have yeah, time for a request? I feel like most people do is up. Oh, fuck. I accept their quest. Do I have to keep accepting these quests? Come on. You have a special. Didn't you tell me that they were here? Upstairs? What the? Is there... Oh, it is upstairs. But I can't go up there. Lying to me. Where are these people? Not really here. How long are we going to have the, the sad music? Hey, Professor, got a minute? Look, I'm sorry I snapped at you. 
I didn't mean to lose my temper. I was rude to you. I should have known better. Huh, I thought you might say that. In that way, you're just like Captain Gerald. You accept other people. You don't let petty details get under your skin. Well, when I was a kid... I Leonie, I'm going to tell you how much of a non-issue this is. I don't remember you snapping at me. Since. He spent some time in the village I grew up in. Actually, you weren't with him back then. Why not? Huh. Maybe he left you with a relative or something. Anyway, back then, Gerald's job was to deal with poachers. Well, they were bandits, but we called them poachers. Nobody in the village could stand up to them. But your dad, he took them on like it was nothing. I was so impressed. All I could think was how amazing mercenaries were. I'd lived in that tiny village my whole life. So to me, Captain Gerald was nothing short of a legend. So I went right up to him and I told him I was going to be his apprentice. He didn't stick around long after that, but he did teach me a lot while he was with us. Tactics, strategy, training routines, it was all so new and exciting. So after he left, I kept at it, kept training, just like he taught me. Eyes up, sounds good. Me too. Be here extra long today. We're going till three. Once I became a top tier mercenary, but I'm just glad I got to see him, to thank him properly and all. I've spent my whole life working to become a great mercenary like your father. There were so many times when I wanted to ask his advice, but I couldn't. I just had to make do. That's how I've made it this far. Just hard work all on my own. But then you come along. And it's like you don't appreciate Captain Gerald at all, or how lucky you were to have him around your whole life. No, oh, it still really bothers me. You might be his kid, but I'm still his best apprentice. Got it? Nice apology. I <laughs> hope you like conveyor belt. <clears throat> Is that Bernadetta? Outside? Really, Professor? I, um, I brought some flowers for Gerald. It's the least I can do. Sometimes I feel like all I do is run away. Anyway, I'll go lay them out. She's a weapon. <laughs> she did like the owl. Wow, thank you so much. Um, I sorry. Well, I'm not gonna get strength and bow. No, guess we're never recruiting. No, it's here too. Hi. Oh, yes. I slipped quietly into the vault and rummaged about, looking for anything we might find useful. There is a group of people who want to kill us, after all. What? This is no time for asking permission. I learned long ago that one can ask permission or forgiveness. It is rarely useful to request the former. Still, it appears the knights have already taken everything useful. There were crest-related objects I thought might be worth studying, so... <sighs> there you go again with that stern look. Of course I'll put them back when I'm done, assuming they bear no additional use. Now... I do actually need to spend some time leveling up my sword if I can. So I can become a sword master. I have six time available today? Hell yeah. 